Hey y'all, it's your girl Simone and welcome back to my channel. So as y'all can see, hold on, let me adjust y'all a little bit. A bit. I think it's better. So anyway, if y'all can see by the title, today is another story time. So y'all, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna go ahead and get this story to y'all. It is like, let me see, I'm on my camera, y'all. I've been doing better. It's 11.45. I'm drunk. I just got back from the bowl and I leave. Whatever. But anyway, let's get straight into this story. So before we get into this story, y'all already know what to do. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, give a girl a thumbs up, and comment down below. Let me make sure I got some water. Back, I had to make sure I had some water because, again, like I said, I've been drinking tonight. So anyway, so let's go ahead and get straight into this video. So yeah. So as y'all can see by the title, this is another story time about crazy, y'all. <sighs> The title probably don't even say that. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. So this story is about when Crazy first got out and um, had me fucked up, y'all. Y'all ever dealt with somebody and you've been just getting all the jail talk and you just falling for everything? That was me. So I fell for every single fucking thing, y'all. All the goodies, all that. But as y'all, if y'all y'all fuck with me and y'all remember my story times y'all gonna remember where it's gonna be like hold on how you fought for all that shit but you said you had a summer love affair when crazy was in jail let's not even go there don't go there with me because that's another story time that's gonna come eventually so anyway yeah um so let's go ahead and get into this so yeah around that time um it was about that time when crazy was about to come home and let me tell y'all the whole time crazy was in jail it was like peace love everything was just perfect like whole different person like i said i felt like he was taking taking pills in there because he was real cool real nice everything was just perfect real cool the person i fell in love with that was who he was right so it was coming down to him about to get out and i remember he told me like am i gonna pick him up so i was like okay cool so y'all at this time i didn't have no car so i had um gave my mom some money to give me a, a rental car so she got me to rent a car y'all i got crazy an outfit and i had sent it before yeah i had sent it before he got out, so he had outfit, had a little Nike outfit with some fresh Air Force Ones on. You know, that's what he wants to come on to, whatever. So, whatever. Y'all. So, let's just fast forward to day to pick up. So, the day when I went to go pick Crazy up, come outside, fresh fit, you know, boom, boom, boom. So, I pick him up. He like, um, I want to get my hair cut. He had all the stuff that we were supposed to do for the day and stuff. Of course, he was going to do whatever. So, I knew, of course, I'm like, crazy, I kids. So, of course, you come home, you're going to want to see your kids. If I deal with you and you got kids, I'm going to want you to be in your kids' life. Put your kids before me, period. Because if you don't, I'm out. So, yeah. So, anyway, so I just already knew it was a whole bunch of stuff that crazy was going to want to do. So, I wasn't really tripping about that, y'all. So, I'm like, okay, as long as at the end of the night we link back up because I had got a room. <sighs> we'll get there. So, yeah. So, anyway... Um, he was like, he wants to get a haircut. So he made it seem like he wants to spend this whole day with me. Like, come make my haircut. Come me to do this. Come me to do this. But I'm just like, okay. You know, so I'm taking him around because he didn't have no car at the time or whatever like that. So we driving or whatever. We went by um, his barber. He got him his nice cut or whatever the case may be. And yeah, so when we was out and about, we just so happened his barber was in his hood. So we ran into his, his homies, which is homies I know too. Because like I said, like I knew these people before I knew him. So... We ran into him. They like, oh, bro, you how crazy, you how? He just like, yeah, woo, 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 you know all that bullshit. So they like, oh, what you finna get into? Da 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 da. This that that and that. You trying to make some money and all this other bullshit, whatever. So crazy like, okay, I'm finna do this that and the third. Mind you, at first, crazy wanted to spend the whole day with me. Wanted me to do all this stuff with him. Blah blah blah. So then we driving around and um, we went by his mom house and he just told me like, oh, I'm finna go make this move real quick. And, um, yeah, we could link up later. So, at this point, I'm not even really tripping. You know, I wasn't tripping because of whatever. But I didn't even think of nothing like that. You know, so I'm just like, whatever. So, I went home. Crazy had the nerve. Before I went home, though, because I was at his mom's house. Before I went home, Crazy had the nerve to go and say, can I keep the car? Bitch, what? No. This is a rental and it's in my mom's name. Not in my name. Because at that time, of course, I'm over the age, you know. But y'all know, if you're not 25 or something like that, rentals is expensive. It's more or some shit like that. It was something. I wasn't of the age where rentals was normal price. Like, you know, so that's why my mom got it for me. So I'm just like, bitch, please. You know, like, I ain't forget all the shit that happened before you went, you dumb bitch. No, but I'm just like, I ain't forget all that shit. So, oh, the fuck? So that was a little little disagreement, but it was like whatever. So the day went by, the day went by. I'm not really even tripping, you know, like y'all at this point it's getting close to like nighttime. So I'm thinking like, bro, what the fuck? Cause like I said, I had got this nice ass room, jacuzzi suite, 
shit was like $200 a night. It was a little ways, ways away. Like it wasn't in LA. It was a little ways away or whatever. Not too far, but it was nice. I think it was like in Anaheim or something like that. So y'all, yeah. I'm just irritated because I'm like, what the fuck? Because Crazy was like, I'm going to give me a phone today. And I'm going to da 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 So I, so mind you, it's around like nighttime. I'm not trying to hit up nobody's mama, nothing like that. Cause I know you're not your mom house no more. I'm try, not trying to have to reach out to people to reach out to you. But it's just like, so you gonna call me with that new number yet? Like, <laughs> imagine if I'd have left bro with the rental. Like, anyway, so around this time it's probably like eight o'clock. We left each other probably around like two, cause two p.m. So, cause I picked him up early, or whatever. So. I'm just like, around this time, it's like 8. You should have been had your phone. You should have been texting me with that new number. You should have been. You should have been. You should have been. <laughs> should have been. Anyway, I didn't ever get that text. So, it's around like 8 p.m. or whatever like that. So, I'm just sitting around like, okay, what the fuck? So, guess what happened? So, around 9-ish, crazy hit me up like, you ready? So, I already knew who it was. So, I'm just like, okay, so where you at? Like, I'm going to pick you up, whatever. So, I went and picked him up, whatever. So, we drove to the room, whatever. So we talk, I'm just like, what you was doing? Like, da 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 He like, oh, I was with my kids. I was with them. You know, I just got caught up. I took them to Chuck E. Cheese or some bullshit. He lied and said that he did because he didn't do none of that shit. But anyway, so, and I'm going to tell y'all how I know he didn't do that, how I found out. So anyway, he like, yeah, I took them here. I did this. I was with my auntie. I was with these people, this people, that, that, that. And he was just like, oh, and I get a car tomorrow. So at this point when he said he get a car tomorrow, I'm thinking like, bro, was you on bullshit, bro? You just got out of jail. Like, you know. Come on now, but I did remember his, he did say somebody had a car lined up for him or, or whatever the case may be. So we go to the room, y'all, and I'm going to insert a photo right there. Emoji over the photo. So it was in the room, it had a jacuzzi and all that. So the, in the room, it was amazing. Everything was cool. We didn't get into it. Everything was cool, right? So boom, let's fast forward to the next day. I know y'all probably thinking like, bitch, you said first day out. Okay, I lied. So anyway, it was second day where the shit went down. So second day out, y'all. It was time to check out the room. We checked out or whatever. And um, Crazy was just like, I got some stuff to handle. So we're going to link back up. So I'm like, oh, you sure? Because he already was telling me that his kids, because it was like, he probably got on a Thursday or something like that. And Friday, so he was like, my kids don't got to go to school, so they're going to spend a weekend with me, da, 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 da. So I was already assuming that his kids was going to be with him. So I was really just like, you know, I'll catch you on the back burner. Like, you know, you're going to be with your kids. I'm not trying to be, like, all up in your face, you know, be a dad. So he was just telling me, like, um, what he say to me? He was just like, oh, no, it's cool. Like, I want you to be there, too. Be there. Like, let's have a movie night. Go get this. Go get these snacks. Let's do it. Like, let's really decorate. Let's really make it nice. So I'm just like, okay, like all right we're gonna have a movie night with the kids like you know i'm not really even tripping because i'm not trying to be nobody's stepmama nothing like that like i mean if it came to the point to where i am this kid's stepmom like i would have an issue with it but however just the situation that we was in and how everything was going down and just well, i'll get to that later <laughs> but y'all it just i wasn't i'm not pressed but you know if i'm dealing with somebody with kids and if the mother it's okay with me being in the child's life then i won't have a i will be in that i won't have an issue with being the child's life you know like i love kids like you know i plan on having kids one day myself i'm not trying to come in to be nobody's kid. i just want to make that clear because for some reason bitches really thought i really want to take their child and be their mama and it was just like girl no that's not the case but anyway so um I'm just like, yeah, okay, whatever. So I'm like, we gonna have a movie night. You know, that sound cool. Like, you know, that sound cool. So it was just like, he was like, but don't don't get a twist. I'm gonna see you before at nighttime or whatever like that. So he just like, we gonna have a movie night. Um, You trying to have it at your house or you wanna have it uh, like where I stay at? So I'm just like, no, we could have it where you stay at. Cause again, I'm like, did you, you know, like, fuck, I'm gonna get there too. Cause it's a situation. But anyway. He just like, okay, we're going to have it at my house. So, boom, we had it already settled down that we was going to meet later or whatever like that. So, the whole day went by. He checking in like, oh, I'm doing this. I'm doing that. I'm doing this. You know, just checking in regularly. Like, he just really being cool. So, everything was cool, right? So, y'all, mind you, when we was in the room, it's more pictures, more videos. But I'm just not going to upload those. I'm going to just show y'all that one picture. Whatever picture that is because I was with my Snapchat memory and I seen the picture. So, whatever picture y'all just seen right there, that's the picture. But I was posting all this shit on Snap. I was posting on my Instagram story, whatever. So my homegirl ended up hitting me up and she just like, hey girl, what's up? Like, oh my God, da 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 home. Oh my God, I know you're so happy. So I'm just like, yeah, bitch, da 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 da. She's like, crazy home, da da, right? So I'm like, yeah, I'm happy, you know, that, 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 and the third. So she just like, oh, okay, yeah, so this, whatever. So probably like 30 minutes went by. She hit me up and said, bitch, what the fuck? So I said, what? She was like, is you with crazy right now? I said, no. She gonna say, bitch. 
can I call you? I said, yeah, call me. And she's going to say, hold on, wait, I'm at work, so I can't call you right now, but I'm going to call you in a little bit. But she was like, do you know who? We're going to get a girl named Dusty. We're going to call her Dusty. So she was like, do you know who Dusty is? So she said the username. Dusty's username, like Snapchat. I said, no. And then she said it on Insta like her Instagram name. I said, I said, you know what? That person do be like replying to my story and stuff like that. I'm like, I don't know who she is. I'm like, she followed me. I sent her a follow back and she never accepted. Just the request to send her her page was perfect. So she said, bitch, why the fuck Dusty just posted a video on Snapchat with her and crazy and they in the car. She was like, hold on. I don't give a fuck. I'm finna screen record. And y'all know Snapchat is a snitch. Snapchat is going to tell you somebody screen, screen record or screenshot, whatever the Snapchat is going to tell. So she was like, I don't give a fuck. I'm finna show you. I'll just show you this shit. So I'm like, what the fuck so she, i said yeah send that shit so she sent it to me then they see no we on the phone she was able to call me i said bitch what the fuck who is this girl like who is this i'm like because i noticed like she did come like out of the blue like probably like a month ago or whatever i'm like but i don't really pay shit no mind like that like you know if they replying to my story and doing hard eyes and shit i'm not gonna think you just some weird bitch but clearly dusty was a weird bitch so she was just like yeah so she um hit you like she was just like yeah she posted this whatever so it was a video of them in the car it was like in a back seat or whatever like that and it was just like she she's sitting in the seat she's smiling the music playing and shit and he like leaned over on her like you know so i'm just like yo so i text him i said bitch you got me fucked up that was the text i sent him at this point it's no sympathy is no oh my god is this you crazy what's going on no it's none of that i'm hot so i said bitch you got me fucked up and i was just like i'm done like you're a weird ass bitch da, 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 da. like i'm going off so he like what did you talk about mind you texting if you is innocent if you're not doing that thing and your girl send you a text message cussing you out you are gonna call her you're not gonna be texting her unless you can't call because you're with somebody proved my point so he just like texted me like what is you talking about so i tried to call him he didn't answer the phone so i said bitch prove my point and i sent him the video said you're a weird ass bitch and y'all y'all ever catch your mans doing some shit and the bitch is just the most dustiest dirtiest bummiest bitch y'all let me tell y'all i'm not even no hater if if i catch because i've been in situations of course with niggas doing dumb dog shit and if a nigga fuck with a bitch and she's pretty i'm not even gonna try to front and say the bitch is ugly like i'm not gonna say oh she ugly because my man's is, is checking her out or my man's is cheating on me with her like i ain't even gonna lie like if she's a pretty female she on her shit whatever the case may be then damn that that nigga like bosses because baby girl you know but this bitch was a bum she was a a bum she was a bum okay <laughs> i had to just say it that many times because she was dusty as fuck like you ever just seen you look at your man and you be like i'm not your type bro i'm not your type because it ain't no way ain't no motherfucking way you like me and you like her ain't no way ain't no way and that's how i was just looking like i was disgusted because i'm just like are you on drugs or something like what yeah clearly off his fucking prison drugs y'all so i'm just like bro out of all the bitches you could have displayed me over even though he played me over plenty of bitches but whoa y'all so i'm just like y'all i was hot so i'm just so fucking mad and he not answering the phone so i'm just like oh this bitch got me fucked up so at this point I'm mad, I'm hot, I'm heated because I know, I know, I had my summer love affair, I shouldn't even be tripping, but that ended a month prior, so at this point, I'm mad, okay, <laughs> and I have every right to be mad, and I'll probably tell stories that lead up to that, when I tell my love, y'all see, y'all see, so I was just kind of, I was hot, like, I'm just like, oh, you got me fucked up, like, I don't rented this whole room, I'm buying snacks for you and your kids to do this movie night, like, I'm over here giving us another chance, even after I shouldn't give us another chance, and all this crazy shit like i'm just y'all y'all like so i was fucking devastated like my heart was broke so i'm over here like what the fuck he not answer i'm calling i'm calling calling my homegirl just like girl da, 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 da. i don't really know her but i know these people know her da, da, da. so since he not answering the phone i hit her up on um on instagram and mind you she never accepted my request so when i hit her up on instagram i was just like bitch where you and that weird ass nigga at? I need a fade, y'all. I know, I know. I shouldn't be mad at her. I should be mad at him. But this time I was, y'all, like I say, y'all now know that I'm not 19 through 23 because y'all be like, y'all always like, dang, you 27. Yes, I'm 27. So as y'all can see, I went through a lot of stuff in my early 20s, 19, 18, shit like that. So I have a different mindset now. But back then, oh, I'm, I want to fight. Like I'm hot, you know, and it's, 
whatever i don't care so y'all i'm mad as fuck so i hit her up like you know like i need favor whatever so she at this point the bitch accepted my friend request y'all i went and viewed her story she got the video on her story so i'm just like yo so i'm on her page i'm looking i'm looking like who the fuck is this bitch y'all like i'm just trying to figure it out i don't know this girl from mckenna paint but i go to our dms the dms is her replying hard eyes to my shit her kissy face it's her this that that and the third so it's like bitch you're weird like you're weird you know who i am i don't know who you are and you never approved it because clearly you probably was posting this nigga or whatever the case may be so i was just hot like he not answering the phone he just then he gonna hit me up after i hit her up because she didn't even say nothing back to me she just was left it on scene so after i hit um him no after i hit her up he hit me up and he was just like oh why are you hitting up bitches i'm not with bitches i promise you i'm with my dad i'm just not trying to answer the phone right now because um i'm about to get this job and a whole bunch of whole lot of whole lot of whole lot of bullshit that this nigga just said to me so i'm just like bro like ain't nobody fucking stupid so i was just like bitch i'm done with you like you know i'm done and as y'all can see look at this ugly ass tattoo right here y'all this used to be crazy's name it was right here hold on it was right here and don't why well, know you're probably thinking like how did this ugly shit come into play so after this day y'all I, I was so hot i couldn't reach couldn't nothing hit the tattoo man up like i need a cover up freestyle on me and oh, don't ever ask me to freestyle y'all depends on the tattoo artist gotta cover up the cover up eventually but we'll get there so anyway yeah so i was hot so i'm so fucking mad i'm saying shit to this bitch i'm getting real disrespectful to her because i really wanted this bitch to fight me like i wanted to say some shit to her to really i ain't even finna go there but i really was saying some shit to her to where if anybody said that shit to me i don't give a fuck i'm finna fight you because you're not finna be talking to me like that like the shit that i was saying i was going off and i kind of do i regret that i'm not gonna say i kind of do i do regret it because it wasn't worth it over no nigga but y'all so this bitch so she ended up hitting me back and she was just like oh bitch like that da, da, da. here's the address so she had told me to meet her on like broadway and 80th or something like that so y'all i'm in the car vroom, vroom, pull up where you at y'all you think she put up I mean, think she came outside? No. Bitch kept giving me addresses after addresses after addresses after addresses. I'm pulling up to each one. It probably was like three. Don't think I'm just that thirsty. And I'm by myself, y'all. I'm by myself. She gave me like three different addresses. I'm pulling up to each one. This bitch not at none of them. She just playing games with me. So eventually he ended up calling me, y'all. He called me and he just whispering. So at this point, I'm thinking, oh, he with the bitch. So I'm trying to pay attention to background noise. It's like trying to figure out where y'all at because I'm pulling the fuck up. So I'm just like, bitch, you got me fucked up. Da -da -da -da. I'm like, where you at? Where you at? He like, oh, I can't. Not right now. We still gonna link later. We still have our movie night, but not right now. Like, I'm with my family. So y'all, y'all know that noise that the fucking, um, what's that thing the smoke detector make when it needs new batteries? He all, they need a new battery. So I knew that noise, right? So when it made that noise, I knew he was at home. So I heard it and I was just, I got quiet. Then I didn't say nothing. I just try to play it off real quick because I'm like, I remember I used to always say something about it. Like, y'all need to change y'all batteries. So I'm like, I didn't want him to notice that I noticed the noise. So when I'm hearing the noise, it's like, bingo, I'm pulling up. Oh, I pulled up to the house, y'all. I don't know if he must have known or what. Because when I got there, he was not there. But mind y'all, he had just got a new car today. This second day out, he had just got his new car. I don't know what type of car he had. So, but he wasn't there. It was no car in the driveway unless he parked on the street. But he wouldn't have did that. He would have parked in the driveway, so y'all i was hot so i'm saying shit to this bitch i'm just saying shit to her whatever she's not trying to fight she's not trying to say shit to me so at this point he's just being weird like he's really like oh babe this that 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 and the third it's not like that i'm not with her that video's oh but bro let me tell y'all when he was in jail he had got certain tattoos like he had got certain tattoos that i know that you got when you was in jail because like y'all the tat like one of the tats it had something to do with me so it's like well it was like my initials or whatever so i knew you did not have these tattoos before you went to jail and it was not even just that tattoo it was other tattoos so i seen these tattoos in a video so it's like bro i know this is recent stop playing with me you bald-headed bitch no i'm just kidding he wasn't bald-headed but it's like stop playing with me stop you better stop playing with me like summer walker said y'all so i was hot i'm just thinking like no this bitch ass nigga's not playing with me trying to line say this shit is old so at this point the bitch is just doing still weird shit so i'm hitting people oh, i'm trying to figure out who know this bitch i'm asking my girl you know this bitch you know this bitch like at this point she talking real real crazy to me and she just like oh that's why i've been fucking this nigga da, 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 da. 
this that that and the third like she was going off like yeah bitch and you this that and the third mind y'all when he was when crazy was in jail crazy made sure he was set like when he went to jail like because mind y'all i had went to drop him oh my bad i had went to drop him off to jail so when he went to jail that morning before we went to go drop him off like he went to the police station he put money on my phone money on his mom phone money on his kids mom phone like he did all that shit he put money on his books so only thing i did for that man when he was in jail that he ever asked me like i would ask like do you need money for this money for that he'd be like no i'm good like because he had his own money so only thing i ever did was it was one point when he went to um prison he needed a he wanted a cell phone so he had asked me like oh can i go in with his mom which clearly probably was one of his bitches and he was just like can you put money off but clearly i'm the bitch with the most money because the phone was a thousand dollars and i gave seven so and he told me it was going three ways so make it make sense it's three people putting it on a phone i'm putting seven up how much these other people putting in exactly so she was just like oh you did this you put him in your books and i'm just thinking like bitch what and i didn't have a problem with putting seven hundred dollars on his book i mean for giving him seven hundred dollars for the phone because um i mean after a while i was kind of mad about it but i ended up getting my money back i he gave me the money back for that when he came home like after all the bullshit but at that time i didn't care it was like you my you my dude and like you know you did shit for me so i really didn't even really too much cared about that whatever it wasn't that big of a deal it wasn't no l for me or whatever but Anyway, she just talking all this shit, y'all. So I really want to fight. So I we talking. He ended up hitting me up, and I'm just like, bitch, you're weird. Like I'm done. I'm about to go get this shit covered up, or whatever. So he like, oh, go get it covered. He like, don't. At first he was like, go get it covered, and then he was just like, don't do that, don't do that. Then I took a picture at the tattoo shop, girl, y'all. I went that same day. This was a long day for me. On that same day, I went to got got this ugly ass shit on my arm, and um, uh, <laughs> yeah. So he's hot. He's like, oh, this, you better not be done with me. So he was just like, I'm about to tell you. He was like, I don't fuck with this bitch. I'm going to tell you where she live at. Like, she's weird. I'm sending the messages to him like, oh, he, she's telling me that y'all together right now. Like, even though he would call me and whisper and shit, like, but she was telling me, like, oh, we laid up right now. And clearly she's saying this because she know he probably not answering my phone. But at this point, when he's calling me and whispering, he was just doing that shit to be weird. Because at this point, like... His cousin did post on her story and they was together. And I'm just thinking like, why are you making it seem like you're with somebody else when you're not with somebody else? Like, I, when I tell y'all it's going to be more stories about crazy, he was messy as fuck. Like, messy and weird. So, like, you're doing this weird shit for what? So, I'm sending her the message. So, she's sending me a message making it seem like they're together. The whole time I know now y'all not together because, yeah. So, she um, sent me that. So, I sent it to him and he was just like, I don't fuck with her. So, he sent me her address. Y'all, this nigga is messy. See, send me her address and he was just like i don't fuck with that bitch if i fucked with her i wouldn't be telling you where she live at this is where she live at she's weird as fuck for that and when i was in jail i was just using her and i felt bad so i just went and linked with her but it was me and a whole bunch of homies that's why i was in the back seat and it was nothing like that da, 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 i didn't know she was recording you didn't know she was recording but you looked right into the camera bitch please and i'm mad because if my homegirl would never sent that to my phone i would have still had it and i would have posted because i don't care but no i'm just kidding i would have covered faces though ain't nobody getting clout off me but anyway so yeah so he told me her address <sighs> y'all it was like a green light y'all so i hit her back i said is you at home and i put the address and she was just like bitch you better not come to my fucking house so i gave her my number because when i'm arguing with people i can't if it's that serious where we're gonna fight I, we need to talk on the phone because texting back and forth i'm too mad especially if i'm driving i can't be just texting you i can't be paying attention to the phone so i gave her my number i'm like call me da 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 she called me she just talking big shit y'all like big shit and i probably wouldn't have been that mad at her if she wouldn't have been doing all that shit y'all so she just talking big shit she like i'm not at home we're bitch da 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 but when i get there you could pull up and i'm gonna be with my home girl da 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 so have a favor them i said oh, i don't give a fuck i'm by myself y'all i was that mad i didn't have time to go find raggle up some rant i had time to go do all of that like i'm mad now and i know y'all probably think like girl you wasn't still trying to track him down ask his cousin where he at no at this point i'm just mad at her too like i'm mad at everybody like i'm gonna deal with him later at the movie night <laughs> yeah so i'm mad so she just like oh i'm gonna hit you when i'm home y'all y'all think she ever went home did she ever go home did dusty ever go home dusty didn't never go home that night <laughs> anyway so i y'all anyway annoying so y'all so anyway so i'm just like whatever so the next day come and i'm just more a little chill whatever like i'm just more calm down at this point i really was just telling myself like i'm over the whole situation 
So crazy. Y'all remember all the stories that y'all heard about crazy. This happened first before all that crazy shit happened. The crazy shit happened because after this day, when it got to day three, y'all, day three, remember day one was cool. Day two was hectic. Day three, that's when I just realized, Simone, you are better than this. You don't need to do this. You don't deserve this. You need to love yourself. You need to let go. Fuck this. Fuck all of that. Fuck that. That's when I realized a lot of shit. So day three came. That's when I was trying to like convince myself. At this point, I didn't talk to all my friends because that day I was mad. I didn't talk to nobody. I wasn't telling nobody what was going on because I'm too busy going back and forth trying to find people and fight and shit. So I didn't tell nobody. So at this point, I didn't talk to so many people. Got so many like clear, so much clarity. Like it was just different. So I really was just like, I'm done. Like I'm done. So crazy was hitting me up and the night before too because i didn't show up to movie night nothing like that so crazy hitting me up and i'm just like you know what i was done so that's why y'all probably was wondering like why are that crazy shit when i said because i don't fuck with because i really was done like when i tell y'all i was done i was done and i'm gonna tell y'all because in between me being done i tried to date other people and they was just dumb but like it was the dumbest shit ever y'all i'm mad because i really don't even know how long this story is but and i feel like i should i don't know i'm honestly gonna tell like i'm gonna honestly look at this story and if i feel like it's not long enough or it's not good enough then i'm gonna re-record it because i know i've been drinking oh i think it's 26 minutes wow i learned something every day <sighs> yeah so if i feel like it's not long enough i am gonna re-record it but i'm not done yet though i'm not done yeah so when it came to day three y'all so it was just bad like i really just felt like you know what i'm over it. i'm cool like i'm not about to keep doing with this shit so i just was really like um you know what crazy like i'm good i gotta go through this you could be with whoever you want to be with you could be with whoever y'all so i'm at this point i'm at my peace love serenity y'all i'm at this day so i'm laying there i'm ignoring messages i'm ignoring calls i'm ignoring every fucking thing guess who dms me y'all bimbo 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 she dms me and she was just like you're thirsty as fuck for posting these old ass fucking pictures and videos knowing damn well he don't get out until next month free bay though bitch you're pathetic you're trying to make it seem like you with him y'all doing all of this in the most and i'm just like Y'all ain't got no time for this. No, I don't got time. Because mind y'all, when he got out, he lied and told Bimbo that he didn't get out until like... So maybe... Uh, I'm going to just guess. So say he got out in February, he told Bimbo he got out in March. Like that. But the whole time he got out in February. Because I picked him from jail. I'm going to know. unless Because if he would have got out sooner and just had me meet him at the jail, like then he's a fucking psychopath. But you know. Nah, he really got out in February, y'all. So I'm just like, what? So I said, bitch, don't fucking hit him my line. Like I said, you're where you could have him whatever i said but i'm not finna never sit here and post old videos and make it seem like somebody got out when they didn't get out so i can make it seem like i'm with them i said you're weird as fuck she's like my friends are sending me videos and you over here lying makes them like my man got out i know he didn't get out i said bro i said that number it was like a 716 number he had when he was in jail off of the um jail the phone he had so i said have you got any calls or texts from that number she was all like no because he got a new number because he didn't want you to know it that's what he told her when he got his regular phone he got out he gave her the number he told her oh this was his new number he changed it he lied and said because he didn't want me to know it that's what she said he said who knows most likely probably did say that shit so i said bitch what girl y'all so i'm sending these mess i'm sending pictures so remember i told you i was at the room and snapchat has dates and all times all that shit sent her the date and time i said you're the most weirdest bitch ever i said just because a nigga lied and told you he get out next month for whatever reason why i said i ain't the type of bitch that gotta sit here in front and lie and make it seem like any fucking thing so she was just like it's cool because i seen your stories when you when he because like i said summer love affair she was like i seen your snapchats when he was gone and you was messing with that blood nigga <laughs> i'm <laughs> summer love affair she was like i'm gonna tell him everything and she was just like you're weird you must be really doing this and that for him to something she, i don't know what this bitch was trying to get at like if i broke him out of jail or some shit a month early i don't know this bitch was retarded at this point i'm just hot because i'm just like yo i tried fighting somebody yesterday i tried fighting you before like don't got time don't got time so i was just like yo i'm irritated like i don't have time for this 
Y'all think I had time for it? I don't. So I was so annoyed. I'm just like, bitch, well, you could have him or she could have him. I sent her the video. And y'all, she was just like, what the fuck is this? Oh my God, Simone, don't tell me that he's talking to somebody else. Don't tell me he's talking to Dusty again. She, I guess this was, Dusty was somebody he talked to before in the past. She was like, what the fuck? This is not good, Simone. What the fuck? Please don't tell me this is recent. Bitch, we are not friends. This was the part about Bimbo I could not understand. Girl, you don't like me, but when somebody else come in the picture, you think we are friends. We're not friends, bitch. We're not friends. So I said, girl, we are not friends. I said, I don't give a fuck who you, him, them, them, her, Dusty, he, whatever. I don't give a fuck. And I'm like, stop. Don't hit my fucking phone no more. I said, I'm good. Y'all could have whatever type of triangle, whatever the fuck. I don't know you probably, y'all probably thinking like, bitch, you was in that triangle at one point. <sighs> y'all, so I'm just like, y'all, don't hit my phone. So I'm mad. So this time um i was gonna say his name crazy is blowing me up blowing me up blowing me up i'm ignoring it was just a big ass fucking mess y'all and as y'all can see it going there i think my next story my next i got a list i made a list of story times that i'm telling y'all but eventually i am gonna throw in there my um summer love affair summer love affair so romantic anyway no it wasn't but like i'm gonna go ahead and throw that in there eventually so y'all can see why i was just so see why that was like that situation that story time school but we're gonna see if y'all see in the story time then y'all gonna see that okay i just gave it to y'all because i realized it was cool but if not i'm gonna re-record it but i want to drop it saturday so i'm gonna make sure i go ahead and give it to y'all but before we go i do have something i want to tell you guys y'all this is just a little small announcement i'm gonna say it in my next story too i'm gonna make sure i just keep saying it up until so vlogmas is coming up <laughs> sorry <laughs> vlogmas is coming up and for vlogmas y'all i love y'all so much and y'all love me and we love story times so on vlogmas i, I got the hiccups i've been drinking sorry vlogmas so it is coming up so in vlogmas i'm gonna give y'all a whole week of story times one week story times seven days story times story times story times every day boom but also what i'm going to do is because i've been having a lot of people hit me up and asking like hey would you how would you feel about um people sending their stories and you telling them so this is what i'm going to do i'm going to incorporate that as well so i'm going to have it to where you guys i'm gonna let y'all know before you get there where y'all can send me these stories so i'm going to have it to where people can send me st their stories the story can't be that long like no longer than like five minutes or whatever so the story y'all can send me y'all stories i'm gonna do one whole video where i'm just reading each person's story and then we i'm gonna react to it like give my advice on the story or whatever like that and um y'all know in the comments we could do our thing boom whatever but that's gonna be in the week of story times but of course in the week of story times still gonna be story my story times as well but that's just gonna be something in there as well so if you would like to participate and send your story make sure to keep a lookout because i'm gonna give y'all the information on where to send those stories to yeah so anyway, y'all, if y'all haven't already done so, because I forgot to say it in the beginning, make sure you subscribe to my channel, girl, girl, thumbs up and comment down below, and thank y'all for tuning in, and fuck crazy, fuck his mama, fuck his baby mamas, and fuck them hoes, <laughs> period.